like I am still doing damage. I wasn't doing damage very good. So yeah, you gotta, you gotta do more than just a little love tap. Well, no, I was. <laughs> Love how those are going through you, right? Ah, oh, this, this game. This game's great. Everything works fine. Oh, 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 oh. oh boy. Alright, I'm gonna have to get out for a second. Yeah, you should go down in front of his eyes. Oh dear. Oh no. Oh jeez. Oh god. Yeah, look him in the eyes before you kill him. Look in the eyes before I fuck him. It's like, hey, what's up, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Just whisper, whisper it in his ear. Bitch. You little bitch. You little tattoo on the head having bitch. This is for shuffleboard. <laughs> what? For Grandma Gertrude, remember? Oh, yeah, okay. From Ninja Days. Crossover. What? No. She is a table. <laughs> My ear canal itches. Mm. I came. It was loud, just like you were. <laughs> At times. Ah! Guys are safe. Oh, God. <laughs> that didn't even come to me. I just landed on the ground and then a cutscene happened. Aggro! <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'll oh, save you. <laughs> He's still scared. <laughs> He's been running around this entire map this whole time. Oh, I could have done the camera to go to Agro's perspective. <laughs> oh, <laughs> see where he was. <laughs> Just fucking around. Uh, he was fucking your girl. Damn. <laughs> I still really wish, like, he, in that one scene where he goes up, and, like, I grow up, no, don't eat. <laughs> where it's just, he puts this hoof up, and like, smash. <laughs> that been great. I have to rewatch all these episodes when I edit them, so I was like, oh my god, I love that. That so would have been great. I wish that was a thing. <laughs> <laughs> that was the ninth Colossus. It's only 16, right? I think so. They're going to roast us for not knowing. Well, the trophies were like 15, and then the 16th one was secret trophy, so. Isolated sand dune. It's trucks. Above. Yeah, there's 16. Okay. We knew the whole time. We were 100% sure. Now it's a snake a snake. Yeah, snake a snake. Snake a snake. You gotta, you gotta shoot him in the eyeballs. Snicker snake. You gotta shoot the snake a snake in the eyeballs. Yeah. While riding Argo. It sucks. Yeah, because he's going to be chasing you. Did you say Argo? Yeah, I said Argo. <laughs> well, I Ben Affleck's movie. Well, no, the, 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 the ship, the Argos. <laughs> Argonauts. Assemble. <laughs> just like, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> he jumps all stupid like me. <laughs> you do jump stupid. In real life, too. Yeah, that's what I'm just gonna say. Exactly. <laughs> uh, I've said it before in platformers, so like, oh, this game, or like, this game will let me jump. Think about it. How often do you jump in real life? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, I never thought of it that way. That makes good sense. Yeah. But the thing is, we still have the ability to. Yeah, this is not the way I want to go. Yeah, it is. Just. Uh, uh. No. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's so it's so deep. It's so lifelike. It's so deep. That's why you can never be porn friend. Huh? What? <laughs> what did you, <laughs> you say? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> uh, I don't like heights. <laughs> Neither do I. I don't like looking up at tall things. When I was in California looking up at all the uh, skyscrapers, all the tall buildings. It was something. It was very, very mesmerizing. Dude, looking up at some of the buildings in downtown here fucks me. Mm. When I was going into Boston, going over the bridge, mm -hmm. seeing the buildings, I, I got scared just seeing them on the horizon. <laughs> They're not going to attack you. 
No, but they were so <laughs> tall. <laughs> they could just fall off. Tall things are scary. <laughs> like trees and buildings and shack. <laughs> Shaquille O'Neal shack? <laughs> he's, he's so tall. <laughs> Terrifying because of his height. <laughs> that really tall Asian guy. <laughs> Andre the Giant. <laughs> Andre the Giant is a monster. I know. He's a I love him in the King Princess giant. Bride, though. <laughs> I love him in the Princess Bride, though. Kim Jong Un. Is he, was he, is he? Is he? He's what, alive. Is he super tall? No, but that's oh, the one thing okay. from the movie The Interview where they say that he's like seven feet tall. Oh. Saying that he is the alpha uh, human being. Oh, yeah. I haven't watched that in a while. It's so stupid and it's so unnecessary. <laughs> and it got so much hype because of all the hacks at Sony. Did you not know that they took it? They were going to uh, put it in the theaters, but then they decided not to because it was. Sony got hacked. Oh. Um, and it was believed to be Korean hackers. Oh. And then Kim Jong un was like threatening to attack the US or something. I'm getting this wrong, probably. <laughs> if the movie got released because it was painting him in a bad picture. And I so mean, everybody was like, okay, we're not going to do it then, we're not going to do it. But there were people saying, like, yeah, I got to watch the movie, it's so amazing and everything. Like, blah, 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 I just keep on hyping it. It's like, oh, well, what the fuck, like, why can't we watch it then? And so then they released it on the PSN store. Oh. So I have it. I fucking love that movie. I remember, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I love it. <laughs> No, I was, was such a I was weird to <laughs> I'm all over the place. <laughs> um, I'm trying to remember how I first saw it. It's such a stupid movie that did not need to get made. I love it though. Yeah. <laughs> like some of it's there's, a little like there's stupid, so many red herrings that don't go anywhere, and it was there. It is. Yeah. Essentially, I just love fucking James Frank. I do in some things, which reminds me, I have The Room, which I, I need to watch, or uh, Disaster Artist. I don't know if I've seen that. It's um, the movie based off of the book that's based off of the movie, The Room. I know that sounds confusing. Um, the whole thing is that The Disaster Artist is a book written by one of the guys that was on, the, that was part of the movie, The Room. Mm -hmm. saying Tommy Wiseau's whole process of making that movie and so that's what the movie Disaster Artist is uh -huh. is that it's James Franco playing Tommy Wiseau trying to get the movie The Room made oh okay and it's it's a really good movie though apparently hmm. I haven't watched it but I, like, I have it I, I really like Your Highness I watched that with my parents <laughs> that was a mistake yeah my dad rented the rated R version or the unrated version. <laughs> oh, the Minotaur cock. Yeah. And it's all about the fucking. The fucking is shit. Yeah, is going to the happen. Fucking. Like, <laughs> <laughs> well, like, I got shit on back in uh, elementary school. Yeah, I can say that. I got shit on back in elementary school because I watched the movie Hellboy. Yeah. And then I went into school the next day and I asked my, uh, asked my all, all my classmates if they watched the movie Hellboy. Like, what's that? And I told them about the movie Hellboy. And then all of a sudden my mom tells me when I get home that she got a call from the guidance counselor saying I was cussing up a storm. Mm. I'm like, what? She's like, you're not allowed to watch our rated movies because you just repeat everything that you get that you get told in those movies. Or that you hear in those movies. I'm like, I, I didn't say anything. There's no cussing in that movie. It's just called Hellboy. Oh, yeah, okay. Because of the word hell. That's yeah. <laughs> So they said that I was saying like shit, fuck damn, I was saying all the different curse words, all different swear words. I'm like, no, I only said Hellboy and then I melted my shoes on the radiator. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is... Yeah, so you're going to want to, you're going to want to, you're going to want to ride away. 
Oh god, okay. Because he's gonna come at you. Come at me, boy. Yeah, you gotta see that. where I'm going. No, you're gonna wanna look back. <laughs> Yeah, like my dad showed me Aeon Flux, the animated series. Hmm. I don't know what that is. Um, there's a movie starring Charlize Theron, which is very, very dumbed down. Oh my god, there's so much porn in Aeon Flux. <laughs> yeah. Now what? Now you just get out of the way. Let him run into the wall. Okay. Now you go over to him, climb up. <laughs> He's to your right. Nope. Oh, there he is. He's right behind yeah, you. Yeah, during the cutscene, you still move. Ah, oh, that sucks. It does. L yeah, I was going to say, you're going to want to launch yourself. Especially later, because I'm pretty sure that one goes away. Probably. And you got to climb all the way to his head. Yeah, you're gonna have to do that a couple times. Yeah, I remember this one because this one was the one that gave me the most, the hardest time. Because I, when I first played it on the PS2, I was like, "How the fuck do I do yep, this?" There you go, that gets gone. <laughs> uh, I can see why. Yeah, it took me for. I ended up having to ask the person I borrowed the game from how to do it. <laughs> He's like, "Oh yeah, you gotta shoot him in the eyes." It's already hard enough to control the horse. <laughs> it really is trying to do this. <laughs> eh. Oh god, he was right there. Yeah. But hey, at least you don't have to wait long. And then out of the way. Yeah. I mean, you're going to want to back. I know, forward. but... I know. I know. <laughs> he didn't hit the wall. Now he did. He's it, all the way over there. Oh my god. Oh, he went for a ride. Uh, come on. Get, horse. Horse. To your left. To the left? Yeah. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> oh, okay, I just have to crawl. Nope, I can jump. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. So this is a snake, but he's more so like an ant lion. <laughs> One more. Hiya. Oh, have you played Kingdom Hearts uh, Key, Dark Road yet? No, I have not. So, they finally show you who is Ericus in uh, Xehanort's Master. Oh, really? Yeah, it's Odin. I don't know who that is. Odin. Just Odin. Oh. In Final Fantasy lore, Odin. Oh, okay. They finally establish who Odin is in Kingdom Hearts. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to be like... Okay. I didn't realize you meant Odin, Odin. Yeah, just Odin, Odin. They just called Master Odin. I was like, oh, it's Odin. Oh, that's cool. Huh. Well, because the first Kingdom Hearts was supposed to have a Bahamut summon, but they took that out. Mm -hmm. And you can, glitch, you can uh, do cheats in the game to unlock the prompt for it, but then nothing happens. The game crashes when you try to summon it. Yeah. Huh. But yeah, I'm like, it's Master Odin. I'm like, oh, that's cool. And you can choose who your team is. Do they ever reveal who the Master of Masters is? No, that's what it looks like uh, Melody of Memory is going to do. Ah, uh, okay. Because at the very end, Kyrie is in the the final world. Mm -hmm. And she's talking to this person, and then all of a sudden you see the person in the dark cloak about to remove their hat, or move their head, move their hood. And it looks like it's going to be the Master of Masters, I think. I, because that's been, like, I've been wanting to know that for a while. Yeah. Even though it's definitely not going to be someone we ever knew, probably. What's going to be shitty is if it is. 
Yeah, right. Like, it was Axel the whole time. Mm, it's just going to be Noctis. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same voice actor, so that's why it's funny. I mean, they should do that. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, he sounded like another voice actor from Kingdom Hearts I don't remember now. But it kind of seems like it could be. Like mm. the same person. I don't know. But there's a whole thing that they have to go back through with it. It's that um, Marisha. His, his speech pattern. He's so I don't remember if his voice was, because I'm blanking, but his speech pattern was very break. It is. And it's kind and of... It, I, don't know if, I don't know if that means, like... I know that Brag isn't... I know that Brag was Lucio. Yeah. But, like... I don't know. It'd be kind of weird in a little... What, what, if, what if the Master of Masters is Lucio? Just... Yeah, just from the future. Yeah. That's what I'm that's like. Because I don't know if he got it from him. Or if it was just... But speaking of Brag... Um... Dark Road established that... Other than Ericus and Xehanort... There were five other apprentices to Odin... And so you get to choose your party from the other characters. But it's always going to be Xehanort and Ericus yeah. in the party. And so you do that, and one of them, who's Balder, um, B-A-L-D-R, he's on his own special mission because the whole thing is that upperclassmen... Yeah, it's like it's an academy. Hmm. That's what they're saying that Skull at, Ka- at Kylum is. It's an academy, but it's just the one island city. Because yeah. they said all the other island cities are abandoned, so this is the only one. Hmm. Huh. Like, okay. That's cool, I guess. And, um... So Balder, his sister, was in the upperclassmen, and they all disappeared, all seven of them. So then it's that you, your class, under Master Odin, gets to go and try to find out what happened to the kids. Because they're training for the Mark of Mastery exam, so they went off yeah. to all the other worlds. And then they established that all the worlds are still, like being formed again Mm -hmm. so that's why they don't have NPCs in them because all the people come back last yeah they get reformed at the end so I was like oh okay that's stupid but then one thing that I think is completely stupid is that they have Emblem Heartless in this too the whole thing with Emblem Heartless Heartless is that Xehanort created them when he was apprenticed to uh, Ansem yeah so they shouldn't exist yeah they even point that out, saying they shouldn't be here. Yeah. They're like, this is weird. Maybe it has something to do with the, everybody else disappearing. I don't know, maybe. I was like, okay. Yeah, but so weird. one of them, their name is Bragi. It's B-R-A-G-I. I'm like, that literally just spells Brag. Yeah. Yeah. He doesn't look like him, though. He looks like some punk. Well, I mean, Brag doesn't look like Lucio. No. I was like, it's Bragi. I'm like, that's so fucking stupid. I'm like, is this just Bragg? <laughs> I'm like, if this is just Bragg. Is this Lushu? Like, if this is Lushu. Lushu. <laughs> is that you? You little scamp. But yeah, the different other uh, classmates that you have have different uh, strengths and abilities. Mm. So when you go to form your party, like, Bragi is for protect, so he ups defense. Mm hmm. There's one that ups attack, there's one that also assists in attacks, there's another one that um, does like special attacks, whatnot. Hmm. Is that one on the ground again? It probably is. Oh, wait, I think I just saw something. Nope, that was a shadow. Of a Colossus? Yeah! And, and series over. Yeah. 